Along the coast of Louisiana, cemeteries are becoming skeletons. We talk about rest in peace, and yet we can't. You know, the places that we, we, and we did not bury people in marshes. We buried them on high ground. Burial plots in at least two dozen cemeteries across the state's southeast coast are literally washing away, sinking into the Gulf. Erosion and huge storms like Katrina, Rita, and Isaac are to blame. During Hurricane Isaac with uh, the Braithwaite community in Plaquemines Parish, uh, there were upwards of 300 graves that were inundated with water uh, in caskets that popped up and were spread all over the highway that uh, the cemetery directors had to go and put back in the ground. In some cases, human remains have separated from caskets. And the bodies just lay abandoned because there's nothing we can do for them now. Many of the plots and headstones are historic, dating back to the early 1800s. Relatives say they feel powerless. It really hurts even more when I know that my ancestors, their, their gravestones won't be there. Since the 1930s, Louisiana has lost an estimated 1,900 square miles of land to the Gulf of Mexico. Some say the problem is just getting worse. When I was a kid, this place, uh, Lafayette and Cromwell, didn't flood. So, um, you know, it was on high ground. It was considered high ground. And... Uh, You'd have heard of such a thing of grave floating. Authorities say there isn't much they can do until there's a comprehensive plan to improve the levee system and invest in coastal restoration. John Belmont, Associated Press.